Hello YouTube, it's the iMac Models 1 here, and I'm just doing a quick video on a Peltier cooling plates. These plates are actually used in the likes of mini fridges for keeping food cool and keeping other things cool. I've actually adapted one and fitted it above my processor underneath my liquid cooling block with the cold side facing down to the processor. So it is quite successful. I'll show you my temperatures here. You can see the actual temperature of the CPU is around minus one to minus two degrees. The CPU core temperature is zero and the actual CPU temperature is two degrees. Basically the only worry I've got with this is condensation. Now if I do look at the Peltier block, which I will show you in a moment, you can actually see condensation forming on the wires. Um, it is quite successful though. I mean under full load in a well several stress tests I've tried, the highest I've seen the processor go is actually one degree. That that's on the actual core temperature here. I'll just quickly show you the processor itself and I'll show you how I've wired the tech in. This is the liquid cooling kit I'm using to cool the block. I have had to modify my case to fit it, um, and I've fitted it up in the top here. Now, if you look, you can see two wires coming out of the top where the processor goes. These wires actually go to the tech plate, the Peltier plate. And if you have a look around here, where the processor is, you can see the tech plate in between there. You may be able to see ice on the bottom of it, that is apparently normal. And if you look at the wires, unfortunately, they are starting to gather condensation, which is a bit of a worry because obviously water and electronics don't mix. Um, there is a lot of ice gathering on the bottom of that plate now. Um, the spec of the computer at the moment is a Phenom 2 times 6 Corsair Dominate MM cooler. I'm using G Skills memory with different heat sinks on. And I've just put a test old graphics card in for now because I am quite worried about what this could do to the system because as you can see the graphics card is directly under the water block. And the last thing I want is condensation forming on my 6970. Um, if anybody has any questions, just please comment and rate and subscribe. Thank you.